Welcome to this tutorial for how to connect the troubleshooting device to your defective set stand disk. You also have all needed information from the instruction guide on the PDF. Here you also can find the faulty reason when LED 1 to LED 12 are LED or flashing, so you know which part of the disk are broken for replacement. This troubleshooting package includes one piece of main troubleshooting box with 12 LEDs and sticker, one piece of extension cable for the hand control, and three pieces of extension cables for columns. You only need two extension cables for the columns for a normal two-leg sit-stand desk. The third are only to be used on a three-leg solution. Please connect cables like shown on this video. Now you need to connect the troubleshooting device to your defective sit-stand disk, like showing on this video. Now you have connected the columns and uh, the hand control to the troubleshooting device. And now from the device into the defective table. First the handset and then the, the two columns. So, and now it's uh, it's all connected. Now, when you have connected the device to your desk, LED 1 to 3 are in green color, LED 1 and 2 are normally on when up and down key is pressed on the handset. LED 4 to 12 are orange color. First, press up or down key on the handset. On time each to drive at least one motor moving and observe if any of the LED flashes on. LED 10 to LED 12 should be ignored if only two motors are connected. So as you now can see in this tutorial when pushing down button and the motor is running and up button uh, the only uh, light flashing is the LED from 10 to 12, uh, which were for the three leg solution, as not are connected in this test. So, uh, no flashing in the other LED. That means this is a fully functioned table that we tested. After you have tested your desk, please look in the instruction guide. Here you can find the faulty status when lights are flashing. The faulty reasons, which part has the defect, and of course the solution, which part to change to get a fully functioned disk again. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial.